How students are feeling after police arrest their peers for passing inappropriate photos around at school. It was like totally out to just like expose them and humiliate them. Tonight, students at a local high school say their classmates are being bullied after nude photos of them were spread on Snapchat. Police say three students set up an account on the messaging app called CCHS Exposed, all to circulate the photographs. They were arrested and charged. But as KXAN's Jacqueline Powell reports, the environment at the school will never be the same. Not cool. That's how students we talk to feel after watching what leaked naked photos have done to their classmates. There were like a lot of girls in my class crying and I was like, oh my gosh, like this is really serious. You know? School officials say someone created a Snapchat account just for sharing the graphic photos. Students say they were mostly naked pictures girls had taken and sent privately, not thinking they'd go public. Yes, people from across the school just sent what they had to the guy and that's how we got all the pictures. Students tell us dozens of nude pictures were sent out. Out from the account. Right? Some had a caption with the names and grade of the students on there. It was terrible. Now, a lot of my teachers has just been trying to warn us against participating in that kind of thing. Basically, when we're talking about UT psychology professor Angeline Close Schoenbaum wrote a book about the dark side of social media. She says sites like Snapchat are especially troubling because they offer a false promise that images sent won't last forever. Our brains aren't fully formed oftentimes until we're in our mid 20s. So when you're given a platform like social media, especially when it's live, um, that can be a very dangerous platform. Close Schoenbaum says she's glad students came forward and said it's not okay. You have a tendency to maybe not want to speak out about it, but I think it can be very important and empowering for other people to put an end to some of these behaviors. Jacqueline Powell, KXAN News. The Bastrop Independent School District worked with the Bastrop ISD police on this investigation. They have not released the students' names yet or said what charges they are facing. In 2011, Texas law passed a de uh, rather Texas passed a law to deal with teenagers caught sexting. It was changed to a class C misdemeanor and it protected any minors who received an explicit picture and deleted it without sending it to anyone else. Before, many teen-to-teen -teen sexting cases were tossed out. That's because the felony charges were considered just too harsh. If you think Snapchat pictures just disappear, you might want to read the fine print. The privacy policy for the com company states that its servers automatically delete the message once it's opened by all the recipients. But the company can suspend the auto-delete function. Additionally, your device may automatically store snaps temporarily, and anyone who looks at your snap could save it to their device. So just because it's on Snapchat doesn't mean it can be deleted without a trace.